Oh, YouTube, yes. Once again, welcome to the depression. This is free. That's the channel. Thank you, versus Creator the channel, and contribution for making this channel a success. For some time now, we have been discussing about how to design a free energy system. And I want to tell you, frankly speaking, that many have started designing this wonderful generator. Don't take it lightly because some people talk we are joking. It's not a joke. Except you are not aware of being a CBS. But as long as you are being based and you feel the burdens of being based that pay meters on others, you should embrace the technology. Today I'm going to show you some design made by one of my subscribers. Uh, I ask a question on what I know it will be of immense benefit to you. I want you to know about it because I promise her that I'm going to make a video on that. And today is what I'm going to do. I believe he's watching and you will know what I'm talking about. This is a good design she made. And what she's trying to do is to design a generator that can run a house. But she used a three phase electric motor. And I know I have not explained on any of my video about how to use a three phase electric motor in designing a French system. All I always explain is based on one phase. But when she made this, this design and she called me through uh, online and explained that it has an issue, but the problem that is having now that the generator is working according to what she talked and she is producing electricity. But the problem is that the area of running the motor is the problem is having because it's using a three phase system. And that is why the production on this uh, area of three phase generator, on how you can use a three phase generator to run your RST or your frame generator. Now, let's go ahead and see how this can be done. Now, this 14 solar, uh, we're going to look at the three phase motor, the control system, the starting power, and the automator size. Is what we're going to focus on. The three phase motor, what is all about the three phase motor? Then we'll talk about the connection system of the three phase motor because the three phase motor is different from one phase motor. For those of you who are in theoretical aspect, you understand this. Then we're talking about the certain power and then automator size as long as this system is concerned. Please don't fail to subscribe to the channel. It is free to channel because more is coming this month of September and I want to don't want you to miss it. Share the video to your friends and also inform them of this channel, the invention, and so doing, they are doing us good. Now let's go ahead and see the three phase motor system. Now this is a, a typical design of a three phase system electric motor. For instance, we have a three things. What make a three phase? When we're talking about three phase motor, we're talking about is a, a system that has a three component connection system. For instance, we have here point one, we have here point two, we have here point three. In this each of these points has a different role to play. For instance now, if you look at this place now, we have, let us assume that is a, a, a area of having the positive. Then we still have another one here, which serves as blue. It's a different connection system, which also work. And then you also have another end here, which look as if it is a deep green, a deep yellow system. It's another different point. And then we have here another one here, which is neutral. Now, as mean you are running a system that, like, for instance, you want to power a, 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 a bulb, or let me say a switch like this. Ordinary, a switch system, or let me use the word, let me use the word bulb, use a bulb, a, a, a bulb like this. Ordinary, in the bulb, you need just a neutral, which is the, the aspect of black, and which is the negative and positive. That's what you need to power any switch. You need the negative and positive. But in a three phase system, you have more than that. You have negative, positive, neutral, and that connection system. Now, but the main thing that is that you have different connection lines. 
line one, as you can see, line two, line three, and then the neutral. But what you do now to power the system, you will need to leave all. You will need to get only one line. Like for instance, now this is one, two, three of different lines. In each of these lines can function effectively. Let me explain to you. If this motor is to be generator, for instance, this is first line, second line, third line, and neutral. So what you need now, if you want to power a bulb that has lose only negative and positive, you need to carry only one line. For instance, you can either use red, blue, or this uh, thick yellow or orange color, as you can call it. You, need, you have to use one of them. And then this one now will now go with the neutral. That is what you see here now. We have the positive and the neutral. Let me tell you one experience I had a few years back before I got the neutral battery first motor. I had a, a pumping system that I want to pump my water in the house. So the, I use a, a three phase generator system to pump my house because I need to have enough, enough water. But the mist, I make a mistake. I went, I used uh, the blue and the red to connect the switch. You know what happened? The switch got fired. <laughs> because I was using the experience of my electrical aspect of blue, or let me say positive and negative. So ordinary, as we to use, well, a normal time, I use you no. Know, if you have some cables, you have positive, which is red, then negative, sometimes blue or black. So I make a mistake and then use negative. I, I, I use that is the red and the blue at the same time because to connect the switch and the thing on. Now, before, after I got in the knowledge of this now, and I discovered that you need one cable out of the three plus neutral. That is red or orange or blue. You must use one, not two. In the case of three phase connection system. So you must you don't use the three cable, two cables that are like like a positive positive. Because in this kind of case now, let me assume let me put it in a very understanding way so you can get it. This is positive, positive and positive. Do you get it? This red is positive. This yellow, this blue, sorry, is positive, and this orange color is positive. So you don't use the three of them at the same time, or the two of them, in a particular electrical system that has two system, two one phase. If you want to use it to power anything that has a one phase metal system, you only need negative here, which is neutral, and then the one positive, which is what any of them, any of them, this this and this i will have this here if you see now in this bulb now which is one face bulb here we use negative which is neutral and then orange then in this switch now use neutral and what what red but all of them serve the same purpose so that is one of the things you have to learn to know about the system we are going to discuss that more as was going time because i know Many people ask questions on this area, but I want you to get it right and then get it. So some people will ask questions on that area because I'm going to explain more on subsequent time because I, I, I would want you to have more practical view. But for the purpose of the lady who asked a question on how this happened, that's why I have to give an overview of what it is now. I believe she's watching this channel or just may, may watch this video and it will get what I'm trying to explain in a very clear way. Now let's take a look at what she actually asked for. What is the problem? The major problem is the three phase and the starting batteries run down quickly. It was, what was the problem she was giving to me? Say the starting batteries was do run down very, very quickly. And that based on that she used a three phase system and three phase method of uh, uh, of the battery uh, three phase batteries motor on the batteries. And I I want to tell him that you don't use a, a DC to an AC directly. 
I, 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 I remember I asked him some, I asked him a few questions. I say, does he have a, a good knowledge analytical aspect? Because that's a that's having a problem. If you're using a DC, then you need something to help you out. And that's what they call inverter. You cannot use DC and AC directly. It will run the battery smoothly off. But she, she did a good job, and I am so much happy that she speak up and make a step to design this wonderful system she designed. And I appreciate what she did. And I promise her that I'm going to do a video to explain what problem is happening. What is the problem? Is there something problem on the factory for system? And then I brought her to the now is, Madam, whatever you are, Place this problem you're having on this battery system, you have to bring out an inverter. If your your, you, your power system is based on that, on your on DC to AC, then you need an inverter because you can use DC and AC direct. So that you need inverter to convert to this process to make it easier for you. That is what I'm going to tell you now. But I'm going to do a, program, a, a, a video there also on a DC and AC conversion system so that you get better and a better understanding. But I appreciate what you're doing and I and, and also I thank you that you do not just go and watch and sit down, you try to make a step forward. This opportunity, let's see what a uh, kind of design you can do. That's what she did and you can see she did a, a web design system. And go the, uh, let me make an instance. Is I advise sometimes that you should use a better equipment because as you can see now, this is very old. You look as very scrap something. It's better to use a you go for a smaller something like a smaller amount of data and the uh, a motor is new to do it. You have the best, and for sometimes use an old scrap like this. Sometimes it may affect your production system and it looks as if what they are doing is not working. But though our own, she told me uh, clearly that. What she did is working. She's producing light and she's working from outside the area of three phase motor and the battery system. So, thank you, do very well. And this is what she did. So, let's go ahead and look at it. You can see the, the structural system, you can see the flyway, you can see the, the motor here, yeah. you can see. The other flower things like recommend the alternator and so this is a very good um, web design system and I appreciate so much what you are doing. So please feel free to subscribe to the channel, share the video and also let me hear from you. Give me feedback on this version. See you in the next version over the same issue of free internet. So then you remain my variable access.